Welcome to Is It Worth It, the pile em up edition, where hopefully we're going to be piling up stacks of cash. Uh, we'll see by the end of this. So I picked this game because it's on the new list over at Mako Casino and because I've had a lot of fun playing it in the bonus hunts. I've only bonused this game three times uh, so far because it is a fairly recent arrival, but the previous bonuses I had were a 67x, a 40x, and a 31x, which is more than enough to do the job on and isn't worth it. Because what we are going to be doing is taking this game, pile them up, we're going to be playing five bonuses back to back to back to back to back to back. I got to figure out which, I got to work on my left and rights here, but anyway, we're looking for an average of no less than a 30x to declare this game to be worthy. If it cannot reach that, it's going to be unworthy. You're unworthy! Now, games that are found to be unworthy can redeem themselves by having another Is It Worth It special where they now have to earn a 40x or higher, or they can battle other games on the unworthy list to battle their way back onto the roster, so to speak. But this is pile em up. It's its moment. I'm really stoked to see what we can get out of this game. It has a lot of fun mechanics, looks very sharp, very crisp. So let's go jump into bonus number one. All right. I don't know if we have any anyone played a lot of regular original Nintendo, like the very first Nintendo, the NES. But the music in this game is from um, the Zelda game. It sounds like it's so identical when you're walking around in the overworld. It took me like 10 minutes to figure out, 10 minutes of playing this game to figure out that's where it was from. <laughs> 420, nice. My brain was like, you know, like the, the synapses were firing and I was trying to recover this memory of where I knew this music from, but it is eerily similar. Oh my god, we actually got it. We got the re-trigger on the first bonus. Yes, pile them up. This is how we do it, brother. Get it. Piling up. Now we need to actually win something, though. I want, you know, we got five bonuses right now. You can see... I've been playing with my camera settings in case you can't tell. Over on the other side right now, that coin respin thing is collecting every coin that appears on the screen, regardless of whether or not it triggers or what. And then at the end, you get one chance to land that collect and try to get all that value at the end. And we got five bonuses right now. I want to get that goddamn coin respin today. That's what I want to do. Oh my god, triple it! Triple it! Oh, fuzzy so Oh, yeah, never mind. <laughs> never mind what I was about to say about you, pile them up. I forgot. We still get three for that. Oh, my God. But they're not any good if we don't land anything. God damn. Like, oh, uh, uh. <laughs> All these numbers on a 20 cent bet, by the way. I put it down trying to save uh, save a couple of bucks and because this is, isn't worth it and we're worried about the multiplier. So, you know, four bucks, like a 20X. So, got to keep it in perspective here. Okay, this is it. This has been a very good bonus. I'm happy, a lot of spins. Could have made it a little bit more profitable, but that would have more than doubled my money if I could have got it. Like that's a that's a hot mechanic. But we won 12.86, um, bonus number one, which is good for a 64x. So not a bad way to kick off. Average 64x coming out of the first bonus. So let's uh, see if we keep her going. Let's go to bonus number two. Oh my God, the teases! Scatter tease me again. Pile them up. Oh my shit, it actually worked. <laughs> oh my god. 
So, 477 spins later. Only 12 bucks, though. Game has a, and this game has a 92.35% RTP right now as well. So I'm pleasantly surprised by how well we're doing. It's not a bad number, but. We didn't come in here with very much of a coin booster, which is a little unfortunate. Calm down. <laughs> Calm down with your sub $4 big win. Although that's like, uh, that would have been an 18x or something, so. Oof. Okay. I don't. Oh, that's, that's clutch spins. Okay, just three, but I mean, that's something. So we got that 3x coin booster now. It gives us another chance to build up for the coin respin. I want one today. That's going to be the mission. It's going to be my new Candy Island Princess Jelly Jiggle Delight, which is a mouthful to try to say. But I got it in the end. I did on that last bonus Candy Island Princess. And damn it. I'm going to keep putting... I'm going to keep playing this game somehow. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Anyway, bonus number two, 676, which is going to be good for a 34x. It's going to hurt the average a little bit. That's going to come down to 49. Still well over the 30 mark for is it worth it, but I'd rather see it go up. So let's go to bonus number three. View. So we're back on track. We got this one on 59 spins, which is way better than that last one. Hopefully that's the only... Only when I find doing these, doing these isn't worth it. You're playing the same game until you get the bonus. There's no option to switch once you're, you're kind of like locked in. And I find you'll, you'll get a couple of them pretty easy, but then there's always one that'll take 500 to 1,000 spins, and I'm just, I'm just on the hook for it. <laughs> Being a gamer, doing what I got to do. We got a nice looking coin booster up there, so. I only have two spins, though. Oh, yeah! <laughs> there we go. There we go. Okay, so we're gonna get at least three. That's gonna save my ass, maybe. We got a chance to actually land that collect again. <sighs> or just nothing. Okay, please. <laughs> I need this. If I... Oh, my God. Does this get the coin booster? That I don't know. Shit. Oh, my God. So we're walking away bonus number three with a dollar nine. is going to be a 5x. My average is going to go from a 49 to a 35. Ouch. All right. Anyway, bonus number four. So this was like almost 700 spins. This was awful. And that second bonus was awful. So hopefully things are going to get better on the fifth one. Quick mention that last bonus, I was up $6 going into it. That's why there was a negative cost up there, by the way. That's why it looked all weird. I forgot to, after I set it up, I forgot to say anything about it. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> of all the times to not have any coin boost. Finally land a big pocket of coins.
Oh, nice. Okay. Little courtesy one up coin boost on there. Three extra spins. Don't waste them. Don't waste them, you bastard. Get in there. I mean, it's, it's okay. There's only one of them managed to hit a buck, but... Seven eighty-six. Oh, yeah, the coin. Oh, my God, the coin re-spin. Get your shit together, bad news, Andy. Oh, God. Okay, well... I'm only gonna have one shot at this now, but... This bonus going to be coming in with the 39x. So the average, at least it's going to go up to a 36. So we're in we're in very good shape. Is it worth it? Well, but I haven't had the the first bonus was good, but it wasn't big crazy bonus. So last chance for that coin respin. Let's go! All right. So not too bad spin wise, time wise. Here it is, last chance for me to get that coin respin. God, this is stressful now. This game is so, like, well-designed, great mechanics, snappy, quick. I know something cool is going to happen when we get that coin respin, and I want to see it. I want to see what they put together for that momentous occasion. You know, with the graphic, I want the music. Probably be the same music as when you kill Ganon in the first Zelda game. <laughs> That was actually terrible. I never got close to beating that game. But I did watch a speed run. Oh my god, there, give me a few of those. And then follow it up here. We can have the biggest bonus of the day. Or save it all and put it on the coin respin. Oh my god. Oh. That collect lands. And then the first thing I'm looking at the coins, I'm like, is there anything that's already naturally over a dollar? And then I'm looking at the quickly over to the coin booster and I get the X and I look back and I'm trying to do the math in my head and like and like add it all up and I can't do it in time there's too many things <laughs> I'm not that good at math alright do it do it oh, damn it damn it what a hot main event that would have made we got 734 on a 20 cent bet that's a 37 X so the average is going to be sitting right around exactly where it is right now at 36 so let us go and wrap it up so that was is it worth it pile them up and we weren't exactly piling up the stacks of cash i had i had a low bet anyway but we did uh, get out it cost us 31.85 for all of those bonuses so we made about four dollars profit on the five bonuses which is pretty cool you know for a game that was a lot of fun and it's got an rtp of 92.35 so that's uh very good numbers over there it was a good successful run uh we had an average multi of 36 so pile them up you are worthy and you will remain intact on the worthy list and the bonuses were like the first one wa was pretty hot. It was, seemed like it was going places after that, but we didn't like really hit anything too crazy uh, beyond that. A little bit of a dip in the middle, but really fun game to play. And I'm going to stay on the hunt for that coin booster because I or that coin collect because I want to see I want to see the big one at the end of that, just like I did in the Candy Island Princess and so many other games. So I'm going to keep crawling out for that. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. You consider hitting it if you like what you saw. Lots of is it worth the content coming out in these starting this week and then into the future so i'm gonna be cranking these out probably five days a week so if you don't want to miss it make sure that you are gaming responsibly mako your way over to the mako casino if you want to play yourself a little bit of pile them up and until next time stay safe and stay healthy